Sail away Sail away We have this great view of Tampa Bay and the downtown St. Pete area from our back deck in the slip where we purchased Journey. But we have yet to take that first trip out. So finally, after several boat projects were complete, we decided to back her out and do this for the first time. Dee's learned so much, but I have so much to learn from him. We both still need some practice, especially me, since I've never been out on her. And the best way to do this is just go and do it. Leaving the St. Pete Marina was both exciting, yet we were filled with lots of nervous energy. The boat was gliding across the water. We left the slip easily and the views of St. Pete were gorgeous. We were headed out to the Gulf waters for the day. Dee enjoyed driving Journey out for the first time as the new owner. We enjoyed pointing out places that we had been by car, hoping to visit one day by boat. First time. Behind the wheel. The day was just perfect as we headed out towards the Skyway Bridge. We had crossed the Skyway Bridge multiple times over our years visiting the Tampa area, always looking down. But today we would be looking up at everyone in a hurry somewhere while we were the ones enjoying the day and the cruise under the Skyway Bridge. Harley was alone for the ride today, and we quickly realized that she enjoyed riding on the big boat. She took right to napping and sleeping in the sun, especially while the motors were running. We would soon find that this would be one of her favorite kind of days on the boat. The Skyway Bridge began to grow before us as we prepared to cross under the massive expanses. Pictures are just pictures, but nothing can really describe going under such a massive bridge. It was incredible finally dropped anchor in the blue waters of the Gulf near a small key for the day. It was great to finally have Journey anchored out in the clear blue water with the warm sun shining down on her. We prepared for a trip over to the beach and grabbed some great pictures of our boat. Putting Journey's name on the boat and removing the old just hasn't happened yet, but it is coming. We enjoyed a walk on the beach and chatting with some other boaters who chose this beach area for the day. After the beach excursion and the first run with the dinghy, it was back to the boat to enjoy our front deck and hanging out with Harley. Harley, you having fun? As the afternoon began to roll on, we discussed spending the night, and then the storms began to roll in. After realizing we would not miss the storms, and they could last a few hours that night, we made the right decision to head back to the dock. We encountered some rain and waves and realized we had a great boat to handle the weather. I took a quick turn at the wheel in between sails of weather and tried to get the hang of the steering. It was very different. Docking was a little difficult as we made our way back into the marina with the winds up. But thanks to our dock neighbor, Steve, we were able to safely get her docked and thankful as the night wore on. Harley went into recovery mode as she always does at the end of an adventure. We were even more excited about the adventures coming our way. So join us on our journey. Sail away. Sail away. Sail away.